Hey friends, Jake Four here. I've had a few people ask me about my channel points and the cooldown function and how I'm using that to trigger scare sounds. Yes, scare sounds in games that are scary that I played in VR, like this. Oh, jeez! Oh, oh. Alien. Oh, God, guys, we just started! Oh, no! The scare button works. It really does. Especially as you can see if you're in VR and headphones on. You don't want someone doing that to you every two minutes. So cooldown for your channel points are very important. So I'm gonna show you how to set that up right now. Go to the back end on your creator dashboard and we're gonna go to your channel points and go to where your custom rewards are. Add a new custom reward. We're gonna name this scare. It is important to remember the name of it. That's why I kept it simple. We're going to put 500 points is what it's going to cost you to use this reward. My advice is if you're using a scare sound or any kind of sounds that you want to trigger immediately, make sure that you tick this button here that says skip reward request queue. Otherwise it will set the queue and not work until you tell it to go. So you might want to add that if you're trying to be random and don't want to know what's coming. Next check cooldown and limits here. I made my limits 13 minutes. That's about all my heart could take. So every 13 minutes, someone could try to scare me if they had the points. You can also limit the channel point redemptions uh, per stream or per user. I didn't do that. If you've got the points, spend them, baby. Then we're gonna jump over here to Firebot and under events, we're gonna add a new event and we're gonna call this scare. And this will be triggered under channel reward redemption. And under your filter, you're gonna add a new filter. The filter is the reward name. So the reward name is what's important. This must match what you named it um, as your channel point redemption on Twitch, which I named Scare. So we'll add that there. And then we're gonna show the alert in chat feed. And then we're gonna add a new effect for uh, play sound. I wanted to make it random. So we had a folder of multiple sounds. So it wasn't always the same thing. So I chose a folder. We'll go to the desktop. We'll choose fear, boom. There you have it. We just set this up. It's that simple. If you want a chat message to roll out, you can do an add a new effect, hit chat. A little bonus here, uh, user scared me. Woo who jerk. That's it. Add that, save it. Let's test it. It works super simple, right? If I can do it, you can do it. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is my first video, so be nice. Don't troll me yet. Don't be a jerk. All right, go ahead. I'll just take it, whatever. Or you can come do it on Twitch too. Twitch.tv slash J4SIN. Monday through Fridays at 8 a.m. Central Time. Would love to see you. Come hang out. Have a great day.